What's up guys, my name is Cody and I want to welcome you to my YouTube channel. In today's video, we're going to be talking a little bit about how you can be more intentional with your game, uh, with your training in Madden 20. The number one way to be better in Madden 20 is to practice. Just like the number one way to be better in any sport or any task or skill is to practice. You have to practice what you want to be good at. And so when you're playing Madden 20, a lot of us like to just log on and play. But what separates the good players from the great players is the great players spend time in practice mode, practicing their reads, their progressions, their plays that they're going to use in a game. You don't ever want to run a play that you haven't practiced offline. Very rarely do you want to do that, only in very special um, circumstances. So I'm going to recommend that you try this for a week. Every time you log on to Madden, uh, practice, run through your plays for about 30 minutes, and then play a game. I guarantee you that you will win more games and be a better player if you just practice for 30 minutes before you jump into a game. Um, today I want to go over uh, and hit really quickly the spread Y flex and I want to hit a couple of things about this formation that we're going to dive into this week. The first thing is we're going to dive in a little bit more uh, and you're probably getting a little bit bored with this concept but the play mesh and we're going to dive into how to utilize this play as the foundational play of your offense. A lot of things that maybe are unclear uh, in some of my videos on the mesh is I literally run this play 60 to 70 percent of the game. Um, it's the play that I've mastered, it's the play that I've executed over and over again, and it's a play that you can pretty much run against any defense. The first read is the corner route to Tyree Kill. Against probably the only defense that stops that is a cloud flat from the cornerback in a cover two scenario and so you see it works really well the second read is a fast a, a deep out route by Sammy Watkins that route will oftentimes get open against most coverages as well but if they're in a cover two defense it will stymie it here you see the defense shifts to a cover two and I can hit the running back out of the backfield and if everything all if all else fails and everything's covered especially if they're in zone or man to man you'll see these crossing routes will do a really good job of beating both man and zone coverage. So that's the mesh play, and what I want to encourage you to do is to practice it. Run it about 15 times before you log on to a game of Madden, and just try. And I guarantee you that if you're intentional with your training, if you're intentional with your practice time, you're going to be a lot more effective in Madden 20. I want to thank you for taking the time to watch this video. And if you want to learn more about the mesh, if you want to learn more about my uh, content in Madden, and if you have any questions, leave those in the comments and subscribe to the channel because we're going to have some more videos coming soon about Madden 20 and how to.